Hello and welcome to the AV Nut, where we're not about AV. Today I'm, I'm gonna be demonstrating to you this the Sony CFD V31 L. One of the last decent, uh, well, not last, but one of the few decent uh, boombox things that you can get for incredibly cheap. This was early 2000s Sony, so it wasn't too bad. It's still not bad now, but this was still uh, not glory days, but it's good quality because it is a Sony. Um, at this point, cassette was going out, which is why I say this is one of the last decent cassette. Well, I should say one of the last decent cassette players, recorders, all encompassing thing. Because after this, they started shipping out on the cassette deck because they didn't include it. Plus, Juno started getting it was a digital readout, it was a lot less sensitive. Uh, the CD player, well, it doesn't really change, but. After this, it started cheaping out. This air era. Um, it's really cheap. You see this plastic, um, pretty cheap deck in there. But it sounds really good. It records really well. And that's why I'm demonstrating it to you today. But, anyway, let me take you around the system. There's a volume control. A proper volume control, not one of those cheap push button things that always break. Um, there's a mega bass, I usually leave it off because I don't like too much bass on my music. There's a headphone output, it is in stereo. There's a tone control, I usually leave it at high because I like a high tone. There's an operation light and a battery indicator. So if it's on and it starts to dim, it means the batteries are going flat. There's a function selector. You can play your CD, radio, or your tape, which is the off position for the system. On the radio, you can play back FM, medium wave, and long wave. It's got this nice selector, this toggle selector thing. It's got a bass reflex body, a tuning indicator, and not indicated dial. It's got those indicators for the long wave stations which I think is from Europe because if we look at it it's BBC and so on but then you got your AM FM tuning indicators oh you can see me I don't want you to see me anyway um you can just see my mouth switch on play mode there's just play mode I'll demonstrate that in a moment there's a display button with my Sony logo CD transport controls, no, not transport, but playback controls. Fast forward, uh, skip track, back track. All down is fast forward, all down is rewind. The stop, play, pause button. It has two relatively decent sized speakers. I'd say there's about three inch speakers, but not too bad. Let me actually tell you the top. There's a cassette deck that is in stereo, if I can show you that. No, you're not seeing that. It's in stereo. Um, yeah, stereo. Got playback. This is currently working. It doesn't have. It does auto stop, but it doesn't work off of the tape. It works off of the um, take up spindle being stopped, not the um, supply wheel not spinning. So that means if your tape snaps, then it will carry on going. It's got a record button, it's got a little bit of a protruding out thing on the playback button, so you know which one's the playback button. Your rewind, and it's got a little point there. There's a rewind button, fast forward button, and a pause button. We've got a C simple CD player, you just push it down and it opens up. It's got one of those magnetic things that pull itself down onto the disc sandwiching it between the motor and the thing and then the laser reads it got a nice gaming handle it's quite sturdy actually on 
the back we've got the FM modes you can either play uh, use FM in mono or stereo uh, it's left in stereo because why would I want it in mono you've got the area it's quite a long thing actually it's relatively long to demonstrate FM now I'm going to turn the lights off again like I did with that other radio episode clips in quite nicely there there's the screw holes if you do need to take it apart it has got indicators which screws you need to take apart to get to it can run off 230 volt DC I don't know what it is just wall power here but we're using I think 220 or 230 volt at various uh, I'd say 220 but yeah you can take six D cells to power this I don't know how long it lasts but you yeah. And then the usual power supply. It's got an internal one, so I'll just use that. And now the thing doesn't want to go in. There we go. Why do I keep going up there? Um, anyway, yeah. Quite a simple little boombox. Sounds quite good, which I'm going to demonstrate to you now. And that's why it sits on my shelf there, my main CD player. Um, what I am going to demonstrate to you is I'm going to be able to do lines ins and outs today because this has got headphone output and how good that is going to sound but I'm going to use it. So we're going to, oh let me start off by demonstrating AM and FM. So we're going to turn it on, put it on radio mode and let me turn off the power here so that we can pick up a decent FM and AM signal. I'm going to put up the air all just like that and we're going to start with FM. Gonna, oh wait, I can't actually do that because this thing went four power. I'm stupid. I'm just gonna turn off the lights. But anyway, so we're gonna start at the beginning of the tuning uh, band. Let me demonstrate to the mega bass feature. That's Ikulani FM, formerly known as East Van Stereo. Like in ninety four point seven. Stick to it. Oh, you. Een dag nog een business evolve rekening bij Absol en Sio en Zeda. Het is keer. Die via een geregistreerd dienst verschaffen. Bies en vies geld. Die toe af, die lente, saam met RSG, dus die in. Dat is een copyrighted song. Zou ik nog eens posten? Hier is wat we met u zijn. Dat is de lunchtime treat. Dat is Hotbusters. Op de all new Hot 1027. Dingen. Now we know how fast a pussycat can be, right? It can be really quick. And we also know that dogs can be really quick. Which animal would win world's fastest dog and the world's fastest domestic cat race each other? Huh. 083 453 1027. Form with the work that has been done in these departments. It has so a lot of those stations on the higher bands from 103 to 106 I can pick up very well, just I don't listen to them. But anyway, that was FM, so let me uh, demonstrate your AM so I can actually put the aerial away because as you most likely know, AM uses a loop antenna and that is not one. So I'm going to put it in medium wave. and start at the top.
not going to be much because there's only two stations at the moment. the books of Moses but we have a much more complete revelation of God the total body okay, that's audio console now we carry on much for Joshua there's another gospel station I don't know what that was but yeah we're going to go to Long Wave. Just like I thought. Nothing on Long Wave. But uh, now that we've gone through the tuna, let me demonstrate to you something else. The CD functionality. I'm gonna go to CD. I'm gonna open up the thing. I'm gonna grab a demonstration CD. And this is. I'm oh zooming in all that way. Okay. Didn't mean to do that, but yeah. This is the Clip Fav Bruna Orchestra with Antam. So, yeah, there we go. And this is a relatively old disc. If you check here, it was coded in analog, mastered in analog, and then put on digital for this disc. So, yeah. So, we're gonna put it here. Just close this. It shows you the amount of tracks on the album plus the length of it, it's 43 minutes. You can change your display, I don't know what that is, play mode, you can repeat one, repeat all of them, shuffle, a shuffle and repeat for program it. I don't know how to do that, so yes. Uh, program it and repeat them. And then normal. We're gonna go with normal, so we're gonna hit play. Now it's playing. Just a CD player, so it's about what you'd expect. I'm gonna hit display because I want to demonstrate this to you. Hit display. It shows how much time is left on the track. Hit that. Shows how many tracks are left and how much time on the album is left. And then the same. It's about what you'd expect for a CD player. Quite clear sound, uh, decent speakers, so it's not that bad sounding. Um, if we press play again, you can see the indicator there for playing. We hit it again. Got the pause. Um, we can play, hold down the button to fast forward. So it gives a snippet of the song. And then we can do it again with this. Or we can just skip tracks. functionality on this thing, it's quite simple, it's just, just a CD player. 
nothing special and nothing too difficult to comprehend but um, like I said it sounds pretty good it's not a difficult thing to well this decent CD player I managed to pull it off so and Sony is a decent company so it should be able to now for the tapes I just want to grab a tape here yeah, and grab this. So what I'm gonna do is okay. we're gonna close the CD player for now. We're gonna play back three cassettes. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on radio, record your sample from FM and from AM, and then let you hear how the CD the cassette recorder sounds on the radio because you've already heard how it sounds the CD to cassette recording sounds because that's how I've recorded all my cassettes to see uh, CDs to cassette but to begin with we're going to use one of the CDs to cassette that I've recorded on this and this is uh, Leon Schuster Heartfall in Paradise so recorded to a TDK D90 this was its first recording. So no, Tape CD. But what the hell, man? Just let go of the beer. Out can I land? Out can I land? Out can I land? I want to stay in Out can I land? He can I stay? But what the hell? Just let go of the beer. Out can I land? It's a type 1. Yeah, that's the best you're really going to get. You're not going to. You can't record the type 2, well you can, but it's not going to work as well because it doesn't have the settings for type 2, it's only going to put as much power as it would for type 1. So you can only really play uh, or record type 1s, play back any type of tape, but you're only going to get the benefits of type 1. Here's a type 2, uh, I actually demonstrate it. Here's a type 2, Maxell. UD2 CD90. It's a high bias tape. It was recorded hopefully with high bias, but uh, no, it was not. And I don't know the sources, is how good it I think that was recorded off of the uh, TV though, on LP, because I'm hearing I hear like a crack crackle in the background, you might be able to hear that with the line out, but still. And lastly, we're going to be using this BASF Fera Extra Type 1 90 minute cassette, because it was good, the Rob Vegas show. On the 24th of September 2022, this is a radio record. It's only in mono, but still. So the problem is, a lot of the songs sang is uh, mono, uh, not mono, copyrighted. And the uh, record I did this on only records in mono, so that's still copyrighted. Right foot. Vega, Saturdays, 6 to 9 a.m. on Hot 1027. Yeah, that is, like I said, copyrighted music. What I am gonna do is, I am going to, um, Record this now onto the computer with the lines and then out to the headphone output and then I'll give you a snippet from the main portion of the um, what's it called from talking so I don't get copyright claimed and you can actually get an example of what it sounds like playing back stuff recorded from the radio on another device I'll admit but still so now we're gonna take this BASF Ferro extra one this is a bit of a newer version of it this is a type this is a 60 minute tape also type one 
what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this on right here Land up for grabs, a quarter of a million, and we really taste how greedy you are. I like it. Let's get into it. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna need to record on it. It's got automatic level control, so the volume doesn't matter. So we're gonna let that record, and then I'll record something from audio console. And then we'll see how it sounds, playback through the speakers, and then I'll go to the line sensor now. So I've recorded uh, uh, Eastern Stereo and Radio Console, so we're just going to fast forward past it. It does take a second at the beginning to get the levels down, like all automatic level control systems. Plus it tends to be a bit soft, so there's a bit of tape piece in the background, depending on the on the radio that's more apparent, on the CD I don't really hear it, but yeah. Gospel program with the verschil, dit begin by God. Hy is die leier na die lewe, maar wat van jou? Is jy ook dalk geroep om leiding te gee? Het jy geweer dat elke gelovige geroep is om ander te lei? Kom kyk er saam my, Dali Smits, elke dinsdag aand om 7 tot 9, net op Ekerulene FM 93.9, en kom bou saam aan die leiers van Moore vandag. Ekerulene FM has signed a code of conduct that is enforced by the Broadcasting Complaints Commission of South Africa, the BCCSA. Under the code, we are... See, that's where the tuning, and they should have a very strong signal that tends to happen with the sound. AM, um, depending on if you're getting a good signal, it's not really apparent. On FM, it's very noticeable. Because FM is a bit more of a fiddly frequency band. Plus, I'm in here and there's a lot of uh, electrical interference. What happens when we make wrong decisions? Here's the audio console with the gospel preaching. Everybody get discouraged and depressed and think, my gosh, after listening to you, I feel like I am just really in trouble. The good news of the gospel message is that every right decision that you make helps reverse yeah not really my favorite genre there's a bit of crack in the volume control but not too noticeable but anyway i'm gonna go into the lines ins and outs now so what we need to say well we got a thing that saying is stay safe stay home and stay Beautiful. Om ander te lei, kom kyk er saam my, Davi Smits, elke dinsdag aand om 7 tot 9, net op Ekerulene FM 93.9, en kom bou saam aan die leiers van Moore vandag. Ekerulene FM has signed a code of conduct that is enforced by the Broadcasting Complaints Commission of South Africa, the BCCSA. Under the code, we are committed to give you news that is accurate, comment that is fair, and programming that is not harmful to children, it does not amount to hate speech or the description of gratuitous violence or explicit sex. If you think we are not living up to that code, then you can inform the BCCSA. Direct any complaints in writing to the Broadcasting Complaints Commission of South Africa. 
Hyderabad, PL Box 412-365, Craig Hall 2024, or send a fax to 011-235-5736, or an email to bccsa at napsa.co.za. For more information, please visit www.bccsa.co.za. 939 FM News. What happens when we make wrong decisions, but lest anybody get discouraged and depressed and think, my gosh, after listening to you, I feel like I am just really in trouble. The good news of the gospel message is that every right decision that you make helps reverse the result of those wrong decisions that you've made in the past. Now, isn't that good news? Every right... Ik heb mijn bed hier in goud hek. Ik zie daar voor mijn venster daar bewegen. Ik zoek mijn cricketbed en ik klap die moans. Toen zie ik dus die hoekje van die andere spons. Goud tengeling, goud tengeling. I wanna stay in goud tengeling. Ik rij mijn streng, maar wat me heng. Het is lekker om te beelden hier in goud tengeling. When I drive on the big highway. Taxis overloaded, so is my AK. I feel safe. I feel lekker. How do you do? I'm your hijacker. 